watching a new video. Thank you guys for joining me today. Today I have a fragrance video and basically it's going to be a haul video first impressions because a lot of these, well all of the items I purchased online I have not actually smelled in person so we're going to see if I like any of them or if I dislike any of them. I really hope I like these fragrances because I did not get to smell them in the store. All the stores are closed due to COVID-19 so I still couldn't really pass up on opportunity to purchase um, fragrances that were on sale. I hadn't really bought that many new fragrances from Victoria's Secret, so I just thought, hey, might as well add to my collection. And let's see, if I don't like any of these smells in particular, I can always give them away as gifts, so it's not really a big issue. Victoria's Secret packages came in. I'm super excited to try these fragrances out. So here's how. They were delivered in these plastic bags, so I have my scissors, I'm gonna open them. And inside is a box. Let's see. I believe Okay, I was actually expecting two items in this one particular um delivery package but I guess it was just one for this particular one I have the other bag I guess it's filled with the rest so I do have a wipe just in case it's um, contaminated or something Ew, that looks like something weird so cute. This is the St. Tropez Beach Orchid. Um, it is the Coral Honeysuckle. Mm, I'm so excited. This is actually the one I was looking most forward to. And as you can see, it's like a rose gold pink. So that's this one. Let's give it a smell. I'm going to spray right here. Okay, yeah, that smells so pretty. Um, I'm actually not smelling any honeysuckle. I'm smelling more of a coconut vanilla. So I'm probably gonna put up the description of what notes are actually in here. But right off the bat, I'm smelling like a coconut vanilla musk. But it's still nice. I would say, honestly, it smells more of a fall fragrance. I thought it was going to smell a little bit more fruity or a little bit more honeysuckle-y. That's like my favorite smell. But this smells like vanilla. I'm not really sure, but it's so pretty. I love it. All right. This is the packet. Yeah, I went a little shopping crazy, but everything was on sale, so I just had to. Okay, so this one, it says Victoria's Secret on the way. That's actually really cute. Um, you think I would have received like a free like, gift item with everything I purchased, but I didn't. Um, I would say delivery was pretty fast. Um, didn't really have any issues with that, didn't have to wait that long. These have been sitting in my front room, like in the foyer area, for maybe a week and a half, honestly. Like, I was super excited when I ordered them, but by the time they came, I was just kind of like, I'll just wait to open them. So let's see. I love the packaging on here. This one, ooh. This is the Victoria's Secret Bright Palm. I did get the, the mist, mist for this as well. So let me spray that really quick. Okay, so I can't find the actual spray. I just realized there's a lot of boxes. <laughs> I might have to just take a picture of all the boxes. 
um, but they were having a sale from like, I believe it was $4 and up. I did get a few mini minis as well. Okay, yeah, it's sealed. I was like, why can't I smell it? Oh my gosh. That smells so pretty. Oh my gosh, it smells right off the bat. What is, okay, coconut milk apricot. Okay. Mm, I definitely smell that milky softness to it. It's toning down the apricot, but, um, I would say the smell is very, it's very light and pretty. Um, you could definitely put this on. I feel like I'm saying um quite a bit. You could definitely put this on for a daytime smell. Or if you're going out to eat at night with friends, it's not very, it's not too strong. Yeah, it's really creamy and nice. Okay, so I just opened this one, and inside is Love Spell. It is Love Spell Sunkiss. So this one, I'm so excited. I love Love Spell. It's my favorite since I was a young teenager, and I don't know. I kind of just stopped wearing it. It just, I don't know, over time. Okay, I didn't want to spray on the same wrist, so let's spray it right here. This one, Love Spell in the Sun, a bronze sandalwood nectarine. Okay, so let's see. Oh, one spritz. Oh my gosh. I hope I, okay. I hope I didn't layer it on to the other one. Okay, this one. And my acrylite it's not really giving me okay it's a soft version of love spell you can definitely smell the sandalwood it's very creamy um, the apricot I mean the nectarine is very light this is smelling very much like a summer fragrance um, a nighttime summer fragrance but it's just a it's a really pretty fresh juicy a very fresh juicy smell a mini size one Ooh, this one's so cute oh my god that is so cute i love the colors this is fresh clean sun days is a nectarine splash and if, let's see, for fresh blooms, our hot and golden hour goes on forever. Spritz, love, and repeat. Okay, I honestly feel like I need like a paper or something because I'm running out of room. The spritz, it's a little harsh. Let me see. Okay, um, ooh. I don't know if I like this one. This is musky. This is this doesn't smell fresh. <laughs> it smells kind of like a cologne. Um It looks like it's gonna smell like cotton candy or something, or really fresh and fruity, but hmm. Okay, um, I can smell the nectarine, I can smell some coconut, and musk. I don't know if there's any pineapple, but I'm smelling some fruit that might be pineapple, so let it dry. And it's dark, ugh, I don't know, there's something about it I'm not loving. There's not, there's like a undertone that I'm not really enjoying, but... As it dries, it's getting a little bit sweeter, but I'm just not a fan of the smell. Like, no. <laughs> so, I'm most likely going to be giving this away. You might like it for me. It's just not really my smell. There's something familiar, but it's, 
I'm just not liking it. I'm really particular about my smells and my scents, I mean. Um, it's so cute, though. Yeah, it's just, it's so cute. It's just not what I want, but it's okay. It's okay. I might be giving it away. Okay, next. Oh, just so you guys know, I am filming on my cell phone, so it might not be the best quality. Next time, I will be filming on my actual camera. So, I just wanted to film this really fast. This one, different packaging. I'm excited for this one. I know what it is. It's the Honey Lotion. I love the packaging. And you guys know I'm Honey Bee Missy. I love everything. Honey, Honey Bee, all of that. Queen Bee stuff. And this is perfect. It's white with this lovely gold and black lettering. And I love the drips of the honey. The gold honey. And the little honey bee right there. Super cute, you guys. Honey and shea butter are made by bees. Okay, so let me try this. So... Like I said, it was delivered about a week and a half ago, but I'm still not going to take any chances. I'm going to wipe it with my disinfecting wipe, just in case. Okay, so let's... Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. I don't even know if I want to open it before I take a picture. Let me see. You know this is going to go on my gram. Oh my gosh, I don't think there was a, a a spray to this. It wasn't like a body mist, but there was this lotion, a body scrub, and a body um, soap. I did get the body soap as well. It smells amazing, you guys. Oh my gosh, okay. First off, you're hit with a creamy honey with a dash of vanilla. Mm, it's so so pretty it's something that it's very light and refreshing and clean and warm so all of those in one so if, if you were to say hi to somebody and like give them a hug um, they would instantly smell the warmth of the vanilla and then the honey it's a very pretty scent it's a very clean girly scent so I it is the cool and bright. I am really excited about this. It's the mini. It's a chill pear and happy vibes. It says, um, crystal drive sparkling eyes and big dreams look on the bright side. Spritz lover beat. Okay, so this is from the pink collection as well I forgot to mention that before and honestly I'm so excited I love the smell of pears and because it's like a fresh smell I'm hoping that it's something I enjoy so I love the packaging it's blue and has a silver top very cool toned okay, I'm gonna find something a different area of my arm to spray Ooh, okay, the spritz. What I've noticed is the spritz, the little spray spritzer when you click it, for the minis are a little bit more harsh. They're not very soft. It's very like psh, harsh, but instantly I'm smelling. Okay, love it. <laughs> um, hmm, I don't know how to explain this. It is so fresh. Right off the bat, it smells like you just got out of the shower. I was going to say flower. Right out of the shower. Oh, okay. The As it dries down, you can smell the pear. Um, it's very, like, fresh and clean and bright and a little bit musky, I would say. But you're smelling, I'm definitely smelling the pear as it's drying down. Oh, my God. So pretty. This is gonna be a great one for the summertime. It's gonna be a great one um, if you're like wearing a tank top. You just kind of like 
difference yourself. It's very cooling. Like I instantly feel a little bit cooler and refreshed smelling this. So, um, yeah, I love this one. I, I'm definitely most likely going to buy the larger version of this. I don't remember if I saw a large version of this, but I, when I saw the mini on this one, I was like, okay, let's try it. Um, yeah, I highly recommend this one if you like a nice, fresh, fruity, cool, clean scent. This is going to be your go-to. I know it's going to be mine, so I, I'm going to need to get a backup, a larger, full-size version eventually because I'm going to wear this all summer. That's it. Like, <laughs> if I'm able to get out of the house um, during this time, I'm going to be wearing it. So, yay, I'm so excited. That one's really pretty. So far, it's probably my favorite out of everything I've smelled besides the honey lotion. So, let me put it on, my, on the side. I hope everyone's doing well and staying safe. I know for me, quarantine has been, um, it's had its ups and downs. Like honestly, I recently just went through like feeling kind of blah, not really excited about anything. Just kind of like, okay, when is this gonna end? But right now I'm feeling a bit more energized. Um, I hope everybody's feeling energized as well. Already, the packaging looks so cute. I don't even remember what I ordered, you guys. Like, that's pretty bad when you don't remember. Okay, right, before, there's the packaging. This is, I can't really see. Honestly, even in person, you can't really see. But it says Victoria's Secret Oasis Blooms. The packaging, though, is gorgeous. It is a nice warm yellow frost bottle. It's very romantic looking. It's very like what else right here? Ooh, ooh, that is fresh. <laughs> I'm smelling like a fruit, a, a very nice citrus smell. So. Right off the bat, it's citrusy. It is citrusy. If you love citrus, oh, it's citrusy, a, a little bit spicy. Hmm, let's see here. It says citrus flower, coconut musk, let's escape. I don't have the entire notes with me, but honestly, it smells like lemon. I smell the coconut and the musk, but it's almost like a spicy musk. It's it's definitely a summer fragrance. Like you go to a pool party wearing this, you go to the beach. <laughs> um, yeah, it's very, I almost wanna smell it on my skin. Pretty. I like fresh smells as well. I don't know if that makes sense. I like really fresh smells, citrusy smells. I feel like this is definitely more a lemon citrus. But it's it's really nice. I don't I think I would definitely grab this during the summertime. Um spring, end of spring, early summer. This is gonna be one to grab. Oh, Okay. This is the Victoria's Secret Citrus Chill. I don't remember picking this one. Um, I think a lot of the items I picked based off the notes, not really the packaging, so I don't even remember seeing this packaging. I'm so excited. I love how summery this looks. It's a little bit of green right here which is super cute. I wish the bottle was a little bit more green. I'm, I'm wondering if I, if my bottle is the only one that has just the green right here, but I would love if the ombre effect started with the green and went downward. It looks like a creamsicle. I don't know what it's gonna smell like. The, okay. Snaps. Oh, a lot came out. Packaging alone is super chill and pretty. 
It's very minimalist. Okay, I am smelling some citrus notes, pineapple, lime, vanilla, like a cream. Let's see what this is. Okay, the cream is from the almond bloom. A sparkling tango, frozen sunshine. Okay. It smells really refreshing and bright. And like, again, definitely a summer fragrance if you like citrus, if you wanna smell kind of bright and fruity. And this is the Victoria's Secret Santorini. Um, butterfly lily. That's pretty much all it says as far as ingredients and notes. So I don't remember <laughs> what I purchased. Um, I'm pretty sure I purchased it because of this, the notes. So let's see. Instantly, it is a stronger scent. It just instantly like filled up this entire area. Oh my gosh, it smells so pretty. <laughs> it's a very um, familiar smell. It's very, I would say it's a little bit more mature. It's musky, it's florally, it's that lily. Oh my gosh, it's, it smells like a real perfume, like something you would get at the mall. Yeah, it is pal. It's it's a beautiful scent. It's a very womanly scent, a feminine scent. Oh, it smells so beautiful. I need to look up the notes because honestly, <laughs> loving it. Let me look up the notes really quick. Well, basically, <laughs> there wasn't much on the website about the um, notes. It pretty much just said it was a floral. <laughs> um, yeah, it's a musky, florally, almost a baby powder smell. Now, if you know me, <laughs> that pretty much describes like some of my favorite fragrances and smells. It's This is absolutely gorgeous so gorgeous it's so romantic the only thing I could come up <clears throat> come to mind is a very um, romantic smell this is definitely a daytime or nighttime smell it's very versatile um, it could be a statement smell kind of like everyone who wore love spell back in the day it was their signature smell it was like you knew what they were wearing like when you'd see them you, th you think of their perfume like that smell that's what this pretty much can be as well. It's very unique and it stands out from everything else. Everything else kind of blends to other fragrances you smelled before. This one um, has a very distinct smell and it's so pretty. It's a very, I don't know, I feel like it's an all year round smell. I could definitely see myself wearing this during the winter time, the fall, summer, maybe not spring, I don't know. I like to switch up my smells all the time, but this is a all year smell. It's, it's just a really nice floral and there it is. It's gorgeous. I love it. It's blue. It's something, honestly, I don't even have a bottle in this color. Um, it's, it's really unique and pretty. So so as I was looking for the notes of that particular scent, um, I noticed that they're having an even bigger sale um, than the one when I purchased all of these. So I'm kind of like, why did I wait a couple weeks? But whatever. Um, but honestly, it's making me want to, to purchase some more because there's just so many new fragrances out. But, you know, I have a problem when I, I'm unpackaging all of these and I want to purchase more. Yeah, I have a problem. Um, let me know, comment below, if you would like me to do a fragrance um, haul or like a like a beauty room tour where you can see all of my fragrances. Or even let me know if you want me to do like a top 10 fragrances or top 5. 
from Victoria's Secret or just in general. Next, it's a mini and it's so beautiful. The packaging, you guys. I don't know if this camera does justice for the packaging. It's so pretty. Pretty doesn't even, no, it's gorgeous. don't think you guys can literally see how beautiful it is a beautiful rose gold um, metallic this is definitely gonna be on my vanity it is so beautiful I just hope I love the smell as much as I love the packaging the packaging a plus so it is toasted coconut mm. And that's all it says it you know this packaging for this particular bottle is was kept very simple there's not a lot of um, writing or font or anything on here they just wanted to focus on that the rose gold palm trees so coconut that's it um, I'm running out of place areas to spray Is beautiful okay this honestly reminds me of an old Mary Kane Ashley smell back in the day um, when I was a teenager they had like a um, fragrance collection and it was it smells very similar okay you obviously you're hit with that coconut but it's a it's a warm toasted coconut which is exactly what it is toasted um, almost like a marshmallow coconut. There might be a vanilla or something. It says sunbeams. Um, yeah. This smells like you're, you're going to the beach for a bonfire party. That's what it smells like. And the sun is setting right over the horizon. And you're taking a, a bunch of beautiful photos and... The entire sky is lit up in this nice golden color. It is, it's so nice. Like A plus, this is definitely one of my favorites. It's it's gonna be in my purse with me. I, I wonder if there's a larger full size bottle. I didn't really notice when it came to the pink collection, I didn't really look at the full size items. I was looking at ma mainly the minis, just to kind of add to my shopping cart and yeah I'm, I'm definitely gonna need a full size of this one and this one it's gonna be a daytime it's gonna be a nighttime going out to dinner going out for sushi when the restaurants reopen <laughs> I'm kind of still like my mind is still living like the way it, it used to be kind of just going out having a good time going to the movies um, now it's just like go to the living room smile cute and cook any movie night <laughs> every night Here's the next item. I feel like I might have to do this in two videos. So just so you guys know, this might be part two because of how long this is. I already know. <gasps> no. No. Ew. That's just really sad. Like how long was it dripping out like that? Like really? I think I lost quite a bit of product. Hmm, that makes me so sad. This packaging is gorgeous. Let me try to clean this up. Okay, so I opened it and it didn't have like a closer uh, to prevent it from coming out. That's it must have like during shipping kind of got tossed around so that is why that actually happened which is really unfortunate um i don't know obviously how much i lost and as far as product is concerned oh my gosh it smells amazing it smells amazing 
it's like honey shea butter perfume um i don't know what that perfume is um yeah i don't know what the perfume that i'm smelling maybe uh it's just a very creamy beautiful smell i don't know if it's vanilla but it's just a very beautiful smell just like lather it it's a body wash and the packaging i love the packaging i love honeys my husband knows i have a thing for just buying like jars of raw honey just because of the packaging <laughs> um and i just i could eat raw honey by itself i love love honey so this is amazing this is gorgeous it smells incredible looks incredible i have another oh okay it is the bright palm mist so you can really see cleaning it up a bit in the spritzer lovely love the pink it's like a warm 80s pink color okay i love it oh my god yes okay this smells oddly enough it reminds me of a a juicy lip gloss I used to wear as a kid it was like I think cherry or grape or something it was just very like when you're a kid and your mom your parents only let you use like a clear roll-on <laughs> back in hashtag 90s kid the first thing that comes to mind for some reason um okay it's very milky like very creamy it has a fruitiness to it instantly okay it's apricot blooms coconut milk that's all it says right there it's gorgeous love it love it i'm so glad i got the lotion to go with it oh yes love it this is very um this is daytime friendly office friendly it's a very warm inviting fruity smell which you might be like what do you mean it's it's almost like a, yeah, the apricot and the coconut milk is really just blending well together. It's a very soothing, soft, inviting scent. I think, honestly, I think this would be liked or loved by anyone and everyone who's purchasing a... I am down to my final three. I'm actually excited that I'm coming down to my final three so let's get to these because most people know like all you have to do is buy me a fragrance and i'm happy i am happy with fragrances and um eyeshadow palettes i have just a thing for those Ooh. okay hi how are you coconut milk and rose and it says calm there you go um, I don't remember selecting this one. <laughs> um, hmm. But 24 hour moisture fragrance lotion with shea butter and coconut oil. It says feel calm with the scent of coconut milk and rose. Botanical inspiration, true relaxation. Okay, I, I could definitely see why I purchased it. I don't remember the packaging but I have a severely dry skin. So I can definitely see why. That's so pretty, the white and the gold. This, oh my God. Yeah, I feel pretty calm smelling that, honestly. <laughs> oh my goodness. You guys, I don't even know. I don't know how to explain the scent except for lovely lovely oh it's really smooth 
The other one kind of just absorbed and disappeared in my hands, which was probably not a good thing, but oh. The rose is very light. The coconut and coconut milk is what makes the smell, but the rose is the undertone of the entire scent, which really brings it to a, like a beautiful floral scent. It's very, oh my gosh, the coconut really makes it a fruity scent. But then the rose calms down that fruity scent, if that makes sense. The milk just blends everything together. Okay, yeah. This is very, very soft. This is like, you put this on, you go. Like, it's an easy wear, throw it on, um, and you're good. It says 24 hour moisture, I, I don't know, maybe. It does feel really hydrating, my hands feel really hydrated. The packaging is gorgeous. Next is another mini. Ooh, I'm excited. How cute. This is like a really soft 80s pink. Like a peachy pink. I feel like I'm a little too close um, this whole time. <laughs> okay, so this is a fresh coconut. The other one was a toasted coconut. Uh, clearly, I love coconut smells. It's For me, it's a very, like I can't go wrong with coconut, basically. Everybody loves a good coconut smell. Oh my gosh. It smells like a coconut from Bath and Body Works. Um, this is definitely when you get out of the shower, sprint this on. Um, you can have this in your purse as just like an extra smell. You know, you're going to smell pretty. I smell pineapple, coconut, coconut milk maybe. Um, really, it's just your typical fresh coconut smell. It's, it's basically a grab and go. Like, you don't have to even think twice about it. You don't have to be like pondering, oh my gosh, what smell should I wear? Um, what goes well with my outfit if you are kind of conflicted on what to wear that day just grab this you're gonna smell great you're gonna smell fresh you're gonna smell pretty it's gonna be non-offensive it's gonna be a very fresh summery smell you could wear this all summer people are gonna be like you smell amazing so it's definitely a great scent love it okay last but not least let's see what this one is I'm not sure if it's something I already smelled in a lotion or what? Let's just reveal what it is. Ooh. Okay, melon sherbet. 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 Um, it is a hot pink fuchsia bottle. Um, with a little bit of that watermelon right there. So. I bought it because I love melons and I love sherbet, sherbet, <laughs> sherbet, um, ice cream. I love just those two words together. It's like I have to smell it. Sugared watermelon, strawberry leaves, irresistibly cool. So this is the last bottle. I really hope I love this bottle. The packaging, it's it's cute. It's very, um, you can see the melon. I love the pink. Let's see. Let's see if it matches the top. I love that the top is colored. So I know, okay, this goes to this. Some in the past were just like a gold or something. And I was just always just like, whatever. Just put a top on whatever's nearby. But this one, it, it matches and it goes together. It's nice. I'm so nervous, you guys. I really hope I like this one. I'm trying to remember. Okay, I know where to spray. Okay. Oh my gosh. You guys, I feel like I'm whispering too much. You guys are gonna be like, I can't hear you speaking, but this is reminds me so much of the love spell. 
fragrance. It's like a reinvented version of that. I smell the strawberries instantly. I smell the watermelon. It has a creamy, toasty, fruity smell. Oh my gosh, it's so fruity. If you look, you're gonna love this. It smells almost like a like a candy, like a Starburst candy. Like the taste of Starburst, but it has a perfume. Is what let me spray this. I'm smelling a little bit of the coconut. Yeah. Oh my gosh, this is this is gonna be your girly girl smell. If you are that girly girl loves to just smell fresh and sweet, like candy, use the word sweet. All of these are fruity, but this one is sweet. That strawberry is really gonna bring it into that sweet smell. This one, it reminds me so much of Love Spell, but with strawberries. So, yeah, there's like something about it that just, like if you're a teenager and you're just discovering, or a preteen, you're just discovering Victoria's Secret, buy this one. This could be your signature smell. Um, it's so creamy. I feel like there's like a coconut. I don't know why I'm smelling coconut everywhere. It could just be my outfit, but there's like a fruity, fresh sweetness to this. It, it, you can't go wrong. It's very young. It's very um, youthful smelling. So out of all of these, this is very youthful for the more you know, preteens, teens, young adults, really of any age, it doesn't really matter, but if you're of that age, high school, college, like you could just grab this, it's gonna, you're gonna smell young and fresh. Um, this one, I'd say a little bit more mature smelling in your 20s, 30s and up. Uh, obviously, it could be any age to wear, because I'm gonna wear all of these, I really don't care, but if you're looking for something a little bit more your age or a little bit more mature smelling grab this one it's very florally and fresh and beautiful this one's very sweet and fruity okay you guys that's the end of my video um, I do want to give this <laughs> mini one that I was not the biggest fan of a second chance um, I think it's the lime. I think there's a lime, a hint of lime or something in this particular smell. I'm kind of, let me see. Okay. It smells kind of like baby powder and lime and I don't know what the notes are. Nectarine, okay. So the nectarine is what gives it the fruity smell, but there's also a hint of lime or a floral that's, maybe it's not my favorite floral, but it's not bad actually. When I sprayed it in the air right now, it actually smelled pretty fresh um, and clean, which obviously that's what it says. Almost like a dryer sheet, so it's like a fresh, clean, fruity smell. Yeah, it's very cooling as well. So. Honestly, it's not that bad. I think it's a good one. Sometimes I like to keep um, sprays with me like in the car, just to kind of freshen up the car, freshen up the room in the house. Instead of like room sprays, I sometimes grab these really quick and it just like makes the room feel really nice and bright and clean. So, I don't know. This might be a great one for out of the showers. I'm definitely going to have to give it another chance or I might be giving it away. We'll see. I don't know. But all I know is I had so much fun um, smelling all of these different scents. Honestly, this is like a big fun thing for me to do right now. Um, <laughs> I had such a great time. It was certainly different smelling it at home after purchasing because in the store, I feel sometimes I'm a little bit rushed because of all the shoppers around me. And then all of a sudden, all the different smells from people passing by. The natural smell of the store, the employees, people spraying smells all around me. I can't really get a true sense of what I'm smelling anyway, so I'm always like, I usually leave the store with like one or two items because I'm just like, I don't know what I liked. I really don't. And when usually when I go in the store, if they're having a sale, 
all the smells I do want to try already sold out. So honestly, they were having the sale. Might as well pick up quite a few kind of already gravitate towards. You'll find it really easy to purchase online. And if you aren't really sure and watch my video, I could describe a scent as much as I can in, in a very distinct, descriptive way. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please stay tuned. Remember to subscribe and comment below. Thank you. Like this video. Bye.